I'm going to show you how to quickly and easily switch between Solidity compiler versions. The tool that we're going to be using is called Sulk Select. Here I have two contracts. This one is a Solidity contract for version 0.6.3 and this one is a one for 0.8.4. Currently on my computer the Solidity compiler version that I have is 0.8.3. However, the contracts that I want to compile are 0.8.4 and 0.6.3. How can I easily manage compiler versions so that I'll be able to compile this contract and also this contract? Well, we can easily manage the Solidity compiler version by installing a tool called Sulk Select. To install the package, you'll have to do pip3 install Sulk Select. So inside my terminal, I'm going to copy paste the install command. And once that's done, we can start using the tool Sulk Select. The first thing that we'll do is compile this contract meant for Solidity Compiler 0.6.3. And to do that, I'm going to first open my terminal. And then we'll install Solidity Compiler 0.6.3 using Sulk Select. We do that by typing Sulk Select install 0.6.3. Once that is done, we can now compile our contract for Solidity 0.6.3. And to set the Sulk version to 0.6.3, we'll have to say Sulk select use 0.6.3. Now our Solidity compiler is 0.6.3. We can easily check this by typing in Sulk dash dash version. And it says over here that the Solidity compiler is 0.6.3. So now we are able to compile this contract. And just to show you that it works, I'm going to type in Sulk. The name of the contract is Sol 6sol And we compile the contract successfully. Now, if I try to compile a different version of Solidity contract, let's say this one, the one running at 0.8.4. So we'll say Sulk Sol 8sol you can see here that the compilation failed because Solidity compiler is 0.6.3 and we try to compile version 0.8.4. So how do we switch our Solidity compiler to 0.8.4? Well, we can use Sulk Select again. Since we haven't installed Solidity version 0.8.4 yet, we'll have to install it first. And we do that by typing in Sulk Select Install 0.8.4 and then to use the Solidity compiler for 0.8.4 we'll have to say Sulk select use 0.8.4 and now our Solidity compiler is 0.8.4 and we'll be able to compile this contract so I type in Sulk sol 8sol as you can see from the output we were able to compile this contract Lastly, I'm going to show you how to list all of the Solidity compilers that we've installed using Sulk Select. And we do that by typing Sulk Select Versions. This will list all of the Solidity compilers that we have installed using Sulk Select. And it also tells us which version we are currently using, which is 0.8.4. Sulk Select is an extremely useful, easy to use tool to manage your Solidity compiler versions. So install it, use it, and have fun coding. Thanks for watching. See you later.